UAE Systems has been awarded a $37 million contract by the U.S. Department of Defense Ordnance Technology Consortium DOTC, to design and deliver a prototype deck launching system for the next generation evolved Sea Sparrow missile angles in support of the NATO Sea Sparrow Program Office NSPO. The new launcher will leverage BAE Systems Adaptable Deck Launcher or ADL concept. In this video, Defense Updates analyzes how Next Generation Evolved Sea Sparrow Missile Deck Launcher will enhance the air defense capability of the U.S. Navy. Let's get into the details. Vertical Launch System, or VLS, is the key asset for any contemporary naval force. Most modern warships – American, Russian, Chinese, British, and Indian – have VLS. The advantage of VLS is that instead of needing to aim a launcher in the general direction of a target, the vertical launch system sends a missile up like a skyrocket, after which it locks onto the hostile target and veers towards it. This makes VLS very versatile and enables them to accommodate different kinds of weapons. For example, American Mark 41 VLS can be armed with a variety of missiles like BGM-109 Tomahawk cruise missile for land attack, RIM-66 Standard Missile 2 SM2, for air defense, Standard Missile 3 SM3 for Aegis Ballistic Missile Defense, Standard Missile 6 SM6 for anti-ship and ballistic missile defense, as well as RIM-162 Evolved Sea Sparrow Missiles ESSM, for short-range to medium-range air defense. Importantly, ESSMs are quad-packed in the Mark 41 vertical launch system, allowing up to four ESSMs to be carried in a single cell. U.S. Navy's Arleigh Burke class has 96, and Ticonderoga class has 122 Mark 41 cells. While VLS are modular, easy to load and maintain, and great for keeping stealthy profiles, they have some constraints. They need a ship hull deep enough to accommodate and can't be retrofitted to a warship. This is where the new system comes in. Angle's launcher is a deck-mounted, fixed-angle launcher that will use BAE Systems' adaptable deck launcher ADL concept to store and launch ESSMs from Mark 25 missile canisters. These canisters are also produced by BAE Systems. So, Angle's launcher will bring a new dimension to U.S. warships. The RIM-162 Evolved Sea Sparrow Missile, or ESSM, is a development of the RIM-7 Sea Sparrow Missile. The ESSM has an effective range of 50 kilometers, or 31 miles, and a speed of Mach 4. In the 2000s, the NATO Sea Sparrow Project Office began planning an upgraded Block 2 version of the ESSM. In 2018, the ESSM Block 2 passed its first live fire test, successfully intercepting a BQM-74E target drone using its active guidance seeker head. ESSM Block 2 leverages the existing Block 1 rocket motor and features a dual-mode X-band seeker increased maneuverability, and other enhancements. Block 2 features enhanced communication systems that allow for mid-course guidance correction, which makes the missiles easy to network into the Navy's emerging cooperative engagement capability. Unlike Block 1, Block 2's active radar homing seeker will support terminal engagement without the launch ship's target illumination radars. The upgraded blast fragmentation warhead was designed developed and is being produced by Rocketsan. The improved ESSM Block II was fielded by the U.S. Navy from 2020. The Engels launcher is designed to be seamlessly integrated into large deck platforms, allowing it to be installed across various naval vessels. BAE states that Angles will use proven Mark 41 vertical launch system subsystems to deliver surface-to-air and surface-to-surface -surface defense capabilities to aircraft carriers and amphibious ships in order to defeat missile threats. Brent Butcher, vice president of the Weapon Systems product line at BAE Systems, said, We have a long history of providing missile integration, launching systems, and canister design to the U.S. Navy. 
Engels leverages the expertise of our workforce to provide a ready-to-deploy system that enhances mission effectiveness and enables reliable ship defense for the U.S. Navy. We look forward to working with our customers to bring this enhanced capability to the fleet and introducing it to international users. By incorporating the Engels launcher, the combat readiness of the U.S. Navy will be significantly enhanced as it enables the deployment of the latest Block II ESSM iteration. This advancement further strengthens the U.S. Navy's capabilities and readiness in combat scenarios. Subscribe for more videos like this. Hit the like button if you find the video interesting and kindly provide your feedback in the comment section. This will help us improve.